This printer here, he puts out a page a day guaranteed by the First Amendment that whatever he prints, folks have a right to read. Let's go ahead and see what's news. What seems to be the trouble, Brenner? Oh, I can't get this darn thing to work. Why don't you get it fixed? 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 You can't do that. <laughs> Have you heard of freedom of the press? Can't fix the press, you know. <laughs> Can you make a good living at it? Oh, yeah, yeah. There's big money in printing. Wait up. <laughs> that bill has Martha's picture on it. Is that? Well, they just said put Washington's picture on it. They didn't say which one. <laughs> well, anyhow, she looks like George. Especially from the back. <laughs> well, I guess old habits are hard to break. Huh? I see Paul Revere was out horseback riding again last night. Yeah, how he ever got that horse on the seventh floor, I'll, I'll never, never know. <laughs> You sure seem to like your work, Oh, printer. I love it, I love it. I've been a printer all my life. Uh-huh. I guess you might say that I've got printer's ink in my veins. Printer's ink in your veins? In all of them. Got a pin on you, I'll show you. Here it comes, folks. <laughs> oh. <laughs> How about that? My right arm doesn't know what my left arm's writing. <laughs> I sure would like to know... Now, this whole shooting match worked. Well, you're too late for today's paper. Oh? Oh, yes. We've already put her to bed. Oh, too bad. Yeah. Want to go upstairs and kiss her goodnight? <laughs> this is better than what we got. <laughs> Say, why don't you mosey out to California and get rich in the big gold strike? Gold strike? California? Hmm. That doesn't happen for 50 years. I know that. But look at the head start you'll get. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the editorial you wrote. Oh, yes. Um, before you go, stranger, tell me what you think of this uh, little editorial that I've written. Be glad to. Let us be aware in these infant years of our beloved republic, there are those who wait to celebrate our failure. Be not disheartened. This will always be so. For we have lighted our candle of liberty in a dark world, and each of us is in charge of keeping it lighted. And though the winds of dissent may threaten our flame, despair not, remembering that a nation which allows dissent is stronger from within and brighter from without. For when dissent becomes a crime, hope becomes despair. Dissent, but dissent honorably. Dissent with faith in your hearts, not despair. Dissent to rebuild, not to destroy. Descent from within, for descent from without becomes attack. Speak out for what you believe in, at least as loudly as you speak against the system. For gentlemen, if ours is a generation to say democracy will not administer to the people, let it be a conscious decision arrived at only after every opportunity for man to rule himself has failed. Print it. <laughs>